Once we were three. On your birthday, my beautiful one, mind I would like to wish you a lot. And you will listen to what I have to command now. After that, you will diligently execute everything I say. You are not my wife. You are actually my daughter. In the midst of time, in a small block near a water with traces of petrol, oil and gas not very clean, it smelled like an old town refinery, but it was home. We were designing as a new times. Life was not easy. on the feet of a child, on wide stone streets, in the crib with the stories of once upon a time, with dreams of beautiful girls, fairies, kites, and chocolate. I was a beautiful, good child like you when you were little. I was with my mother all day. Too bad, I didn't have a grandmother. <clears throat> I was my father and mother wonder. I was fearless. I was a their desired child, unprecedented joy. Once we are three, oh, what beautiful times. Dad was a young engineer and had just finished. He worked day and night at the institute and still hadn't forgotten. Beautiful life, a telega with a cow and three houses. Worked Saturday too to have goodies on the tables. Even Sunday, many times, without caring, he took him briefcase to job or on frequent trips. The day with my mother was good.
because she took care of me to grow up beautiful and healthy as it should be. Washed laundry uh, more by hand with some soap. When you saw them, they were uh, like stones, but yellow. She took my hand and we walked to the market, crossing a small, a so-called park with grass. Three fillings with gas lanterns for light, the down bridge thrown over the water with gasoline because then there was only one car per hour my feet hurt in my little boy's sandals. Then I found out what it means to walk. More than that, my mother pulled me up with shoes. I was too small, too tired, by the road too wide, and its end was never in sight. My mother was young, curly haired and very beautiful. She was highly appreciated by passers, by vendors. I heard words of admiration, but also of scorn, because the new Romania that we all wanted was rich. God, it was run by evil torturers and security guards. It was paralyzed by the so-called communists. It was full of stupid, mean, bad militia men. It was suffocated by naive Basque wearing peasant towns people. All were upside down. Fear was the menu of the day. We were statistics, living like days from the mercy box. I was looking with my little eyes and the schools in the neighborhood. 
run by executives and guys with an iron fist. They and the student sang, I look through the iron bars. They were building the new iron man and woman. Horse drawn carts with iron horse shoes passed by to believe in all this. Honestly, uh, you were a big sucker. Uh, tonight, I looked at the sky with moon and stars <clears throat> through the large clean windows without curtains. The workers cotton wool factory was always on fire. At the night they were taken to the hospital with the rescuers. But there were still no tales, cold, darkness, and hunger. The radiators burned hot all day and night. The hot water was boiled and the taps were always running. We put large trays of cold water on the radiators. Let the air not be so dry in all the rooms <clears throat> and the three of us bust daily with full tubes uh, not like today exclusively a shower looking at the Water matters. We didn't have bath foams or fine shampoos, but there was a care soap for everyone. We didn't have expensive periodontal tooth pastas, but mom and dad bought spring and crystal. There were no home or family without a few children. There was early competition in births and marriages. What are you up to? It's no longer fashionable to be alone.
as I used to say after the failed falls revolutions. You too must have offspring like humans, daughters and sons, not the lonely, depressed, barren life on the plains. Why to work to earn money, wealth, other nonsense, and after you let everything be lost because you have no one left to live. Houses, lands, cars, money, legacies. No, that's not why we educated you so highly. Through nurseries, kindergartens, high schools, and many faculties. To be a deadline, like trains without followers. Not to make your mother burst into tears not to open the door to your mother in passions, not to disown and discredit both of your parents, not to invent false scenarios with others. You are glad you have money now and you are doing fine without me. But when you were in our hands, you know very well a small mistake in my strategy or vision was necessary that nothing should be chosen from you. We were three ones and it was beautiful. Whether you like it or not, we went on holidays together with our family. We were three of us with them too, and you wait for his money to buy your dolls, Christmas trees, or a hundred original jeans. May he forever give you the best food all your life. To pay you many times what your mouth wants to say. To raise 
and educate you to be of help to them when they want to get out of bed or in the stroller when they will starve or when he will be left alone to be at their head at the cemetery when they die like any other being you have been dozen of times with me and my dead to the graves you were always wide eyed sad and brooding you said yes we are two times three be no worries when my mother died you didn't come to my father either all the angels howled and the gods wept the heavens blue skies tears full of unspoken resentments our two parental hearts cried in unison how to go to some foreign and unconscious cops how to pay excessively much to some lawyers to stage scenarios of liars and scoundrels for which they can be fired and jailed for false use of false and gross misrepresentation with gross forgeries and cowardly false testimony to obtain a wrongful conviction against your father which can always land you in jail to what are you seek now aren't we three of us anymore well as in a life on the run and missing from home you will wake up next to Jesus one morning. You will ascend to the skies over green fields. You will tell for the last time what am I looking for 
in life. Once we were free, but now it's getting better. Thank God.